Howdy doody guys, it's Lara here from Rapture Arts. Now, the fan kick, or your windmill as I call it, is something that looks amazing up the pole. And it's something that you can use really well to get your legs unstuck from around the pole. And to manage to do lots of flowing floor work. Now before you do it on the pole, I highly suggest doing it on the ground. Each training session, practice it on the ground first. That way you get an idea and your legs warm up with the motions that they're going to be doing. So, how to do it? It's a little bit complicated, but once you get the flow of it, it works really, really well and you can start to put little flourishes in to help as well. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start flat on our back. Now this is something you can do on your back, you can do raised up on your elbows, like I said, you can even do it up the pole. So, laying on our back, we're going to bring one leg and we're going to put it across the other one. So bring one leg across. Now we're gonna point it to the sky and out to the side. So we're gonna do that again. One leg across, up to the sky, out to the side. Now to make this flow, we're gonna add the second leg in. So our first leg comes across our body. When it comes up to the sky, your second leg is going to come out to where the first leg started, so out to the side. And then it's going to follow like it's drawing a rainbow. So this leg comes down to the side, and this leg comes up. Then it goes down to the side, so it's just followed. Now you end up in a really messy knot. And if you're up the pole doing your windmill or your fan kick, you feel like you haven't achieved when you've landed. All we need to do is roll onto our stomach and we're done. That roll onto your stomach, or a pivot if you're up the pole, makes you feel like you've finally finished the move and you're not stuck in a knot. Now it's, it's important to practice both sides, so go back the other way. Kick across, up to the sky, let it follow and finish drawing the rainbow as it comes around and onto your stomach. Now I find I always keep one leg bent and that way, it looks nice and posed, but it also helps you. If you're gonna to go to other moves, you can rotate over that knee and it's less of a lever for you to move about in. So it really, really helps. So again, let's have a look at it. We kick across and we go up to the sky. Our, first leg, our second leg comes out, sorry. And then it follows as one leg comes down, the other leg goes up. As it comes around, you roll onto your stomach to finish the move. Kick up, finish the rainbow, roll. Okay, just remember, across, sky, to the side. The other leg does the same. So I hope that helps. If your legs are stuck around the pole, it's a fantastic way to just be able to lean back and get them to the other side of the pole so that you're not trapped really close into the pole. But it's also really effective floor work. Have fun, enjoy the journey, and thank you.